Warren Buffett, seven things the poor waste money on. Do you want to succeed in life? Do you want to live with all the possible comforts? I'm sure your answer is yes, of course. Then you've come to the right place, because today I'm going to teach you how to better manage your finances and control unnecessary expenses. I will show you seven things that the poor waste money on, according to Warren Buffett, the world's greatest investor. The last item on the list will surprise you, so stay until the end to not miss any details. Also, I invite you to like and subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell to be one step closer to success in your life. Without further ado, let's get started. Number 1. Gambling Gambling is detrimental to your finances. Although Warren Buffett states that there's nothing wrong with playing once in a while if you expect to increase your income and generate wealth, it will only lead you to bankruptcy. Understand one thing. Every time you play on these machines, like slot machines, it is very likely that your ambition will make you want to spend more and more, which will make you spend all your money in a matter of minutes. Luck is for mediocre people. Success is for those who don't rely on luck. Always remember that. Number 2. Buying a house. Surprisingly, unlike the poor, the rich don't own a house, at least not at the beginning of their journey toward success. Instead, they rent a house while building the necessary assets to be able to buy that same house. One of the main mistakes that poor people make is getting into debt to buy a house, which can be completely destructive to their economy. Putting all your assets, all your savings, and possibly adding a debt in one place is risky. Furthermore, owning a house won't make you money. On the contrary, it will generate expenses. The risk ends up being too high. Buffett doesn't mean that having a house of your own to share with your family is completely wrong. What's wrong is buying a house with a lot of debt because that will lead you to bankruptcy slowly. Number 3. Paying for a gym without commitment. According to statistics, around 61 million people were gym members in 2017, but reports show that almost 70% of members stop using them after the first few months. Most gyms rely on people paying their dues and not showing up. People join gyms to improve their health and physical fitness. Gyms offer a variety of equipment and various classes to choose from. However, many people join a gym without being committed to exercising regularly. Having a gym membership doesn't make sense if you don't use it regularly. There are smarter, free entertainment options. There are many low-cost and free options for fitness. Many people prefer outdoor exercises such as walking, playing sports with friends, running, or hiking. Train your mind and be persistent until you can commit to an exercise routine. Number 4. Luxury brands. As mentioned earlier, the poor buy things they don't need, regardless of the price. We know that millionaires can afford fashionable clothes, mansions, luxury cars, designer clothing, among other things. However, this doesn't mean they're spending their hard-earned money on material possessions from luxury brands. They can afford to acquire these things in whatever quantity they want, but occasionally, you see them wearing simple $120 watches or using the same phone for many years. So, it's not enough to simply avoid buying products you don't need. It's necessary to analyze if it's the best option. For example, you should consider if it's better to pay $1,200 for a simple luxury brand t-shirt or if it's more convenient to pay $110 for a t-shirt of the same quality but without the brand logo. Both can have the same quality. Only the brand makes the difference. Number 5. Buying a new car. Buying a new car is one of the worst financial decisions the new generations will make. This is because, as soon as you drive the car off the dealership and take it on the road, the vehicle starts to depreciate. The value of your car will decrease between 20% and 30% by the end of the first year, and in five years, it will lose at least 60% of its initial value. Most people borrow money to buy a new car, but they're essentially borrowing money to buy an asset that immediately depreciates by 30%. But it's not all bad news. 
If you want to have a shiny car that smells new without getting into debt with the bank, you can buy a used car with two or three years of use because the vehicle will be almost new, and you can purchase it with a 30% discount due to its usage time. Number 6. Watching TV and playing video games. An important fact revealed by Warren Buffett is that middle-class and lower-class households waste time watching television or playing video games. This is much more common in these households than in wealthier homes. He explains that, first of all, they waste time and money acquiring the latest TV packages. Secondly, they waste their time playing video games instead of using it for more constructive activities or learning how to generate new income and grow their wealth. For example, people from higher social classes read much more consistently than poorer people who often spend their free time watching Netflix or other streaming services. Number 7. Extravagant Vacations Having experiences like traveling is very important. They are achievements we want to accomplish in our lives. However, if these experiences are not well planned, they can end up being ruined. Often, poor people go into debt to be able to travel for a few weeks. It's undeniable that the experience can be great, but you will have to pay for it for years, causing you to regret making that decision. Therefore, if you want to fully enjoy it, be very careful not to think emotionally and overlook the rational side when planning your dream trip. Don't do it through loans or debts, because these vacations can end up being a total nightmare for your wallet. Plan your finances well and choose the right time to have a great trip. In this video, we saw that the main mistakes of poor people are gambling games, as they are highly detrimental to finances and can lead to bankruptcy by encouraging excessive spending. Next, we saw that the idea of buying a house is questioned, as Buffett suggests that it is wiser to rent while building financial assets. Paying for a gym without commitment is also considered a waste, as many people do not use it regularly, while there are more affordable and free options for exercising. Buying luxury brands should be left for when we achieve financial freedom, because the brand should not justify a high price, and cheaper alternatives may have the same quality. Furthermore, buying a new car can be a poor financial decision since vehicles depreciate rapidly, and we have the option to buy used cars. Watching TV and playing video games excessively are considered wastes of time and money by Buffett. Finally, while vacations are important, we advise caution when planning trips to avoid debt or financial regrets. Thank you for watching until here. I hope Buffett's wisdom is very useful to you and our video has added some value to your life. If you like the video, please leave a big like and subscribe to our channel as we are bringing videos weekly about wealth creation, investments, and success, as well as more finance-related content. Turn on the notification bell to not miss any of the content we have prepared for you. See you in the next video. Goodbye.